Brilliance Audio presents the unabridged recording of No Man's Mistress by Mary Balog. Performed by Rosalind Landar. Chapter One The picturesque village of Trellick, nestled in a river valley in Somersetshire, was usually a quiet little backwater, but not on this particular day. By the middle of the afternoon, it appeared that every villager and every country dweller for miles around must be out of doors, milling about the village green, enjoying the revelries. The maypole at the centre of the green, its coloured ribbons fluttering in the breeze, proclaimed the occasion. It was May Day. Later, the young men would dance about the maypole with the partners of their choice, as they did with great energy and enthusiasm every year. Meanwhile, there were races and other contests to draw attention to the green. Pitched about its perimeter were tented booths with their offerings of appetizing foods, eye-catching baubles, and challenging games of skill or strength or chance. The weather had cooperated in magnificent fashion with warm sunshine and a cloudless blue sky. Women and girls had discarded shawls and pelisses they had worn in the morning. A few men and most boys remained in their shirt sleeves. After engaging in one of the more strenuous contests, tables and chairs had been carried from the church hall onto the lawn outside, so that tea and cakes could be served in full view of all the merriment. Not to be outdone, on an adjacent side of the village green, the boar's head had its own tables and benches set up outside for the convenience of those folk who preferred ale to tea. A few strangers, on their way past the village to destinations unknown. Stopped off for varying periods of time to observe the fun, and even in some cases to participate.